you guys, welcome back. Uh, I have another video for Lana's fur whitening kit. Uh, you have a fur coat, it's beautiful white, it's handed down to you. Don't freak out. Uh, I know it can be a little scary wearing white clothes and always have to make sure to not get anything on it. It's okay. Um, if it gets a little dingy or dirty, that's what the fur whitening kit is for. And it has everything you need in it. It has the Lana's fur whitener, the fur pad, Lana's fur brush, and really easy to follow instructions on this nice little handy card. Uh, if you get a really serious stain, uh, up for the Lana's fur stain remover, but for just your everyday cleaning, this kit would be perfect for you. Um, so again, it's really easy instructions. Um, First thing you want to do is shake the fur coat, preferably outside um, if it's really dirty so that you don't get your home dirty. Shake it thoroughly out to get all of the big dirt particles out of it. Once you've done that, you can hang it back up. Take Lana's fur brush and brush the remaining particles out of the coat and brush it throughout, making sure to brush in the direction that the fur is going so that you don't damage your fur coat. So brush it throughout the entire thing. This is going to lift the hairs up, which is going to be really easy to get the solution in there to really penetrate it. So once you've brushed it thoroughly, hang it back up. Take Lana's fur whitener and spray it in the areas that are dirty. Uh, don't soak the fur coat. Make sure to get a nice, even, thin layer. You can feel it's a little damp. Um, it's okay to get any of these products anywhere. It's all natural solutions. Uh, it's organic. It's okay to get it on any of your own personal clothes or furniture or anything. So spray it throughout. And then you're going to take Lana's fur pad and in the direction that the fur is going, again, just rub the dirt out of the fur coat. If the pad gets dirty, it's okay to just wash it with soap and water anywhere. Take a dry paper towel, make sure to dry it back up before you use it again. It should be clean and dry when you use it. So get all of the dirt out of the fur throughout the entire thing. Obviously, I've sped up the process now. Uh, you're going to want to take a little bit more time to clean it, depending on how dirty it is. And then after it dries, which should take about two hours, and you want to dry it in a well-lit room. If it's nice out, uh, go ahead and just put it outside, just not in a spot that's too sunny, because you don't want to damage it. But in a well-lit room or outside somewhere, maybe in your garage, just let it hang for about two hours. That should be good enough. You can feel it. It'll be dry. And then take Lana's fur brush again and just brush it back down so it's nice and smooth after you've matted it down with the pad. And brush it throughout the entire thing. And then you'll be good to go. Really easy. Anyone can do it at home. It'll save you the trouble and the money of taking it to the fur cleaners. You buy the kit, this will last you a long time. Um, you should be cleaning it about twice a year minimum. Um, and there's plenty of solution here for more than that. So you'll save a lot of money. Anyone can do it at home.